All right, y'all. Peace and blessings. God bless you all. I'm Jarvis Kingston, and I hope that y'all doing all right and staying strong and solid in these times that run. I pray that you have repented and that you were baptized. I pray that you were safe, protected, and prayed up. And I just pray that whatever situation that you're going through, that the Lord is with you, that he guides you, protects you, he looks out for you, he comforts you. I pray that your mental health gets better and that you become more strong and wise in the Lord. I pray that you keep fighting the good fight of faith. You keep running your race. You keep your eyes fixed on the Messiah. You keep your eyes fixed on the prize. You stay on that narrow straight gate path and you help out plenty of people along your journey forevermore. Amen. Always remember that the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you and that the Messiah intercedes for you. The spirit intercedes for you as well. So always stay thankful, grateful, appreciate it. Take it one day at a time. Most definitely let us thank the Lord for another day. Let us thank the Lord for waking us up and giving us another day to seek his face. Let us thank the Lord for food in our belly, clothes on our back and a roof over our head. Let us thank the Lord for protecting us coming in and going out. Guiding us through the morning, getting us through the afternoon, getting us through the evenings, getting us through the nights, getting us through the week. He is constantly looking out for us with his grace, mercy, favor, love, the outstretched arm of God, the mighty hand of God, the finger of God, his word, his only begotten son who died for our sins. There's plenty of things the Lord has done for us throughout our lifetime and continues to keep doing for us because his mercy is everlasting and his truth endures forever. Amen. Always keep him first. Always worship him, thank him, praise him, call him, sing to him, and trust him in everything you got going on in your life. Amen. Hallelujah. Welcome, everyone. I appreciate all of you for listening. Support means a lot to me. I love you all. Praying for you all. Let us always uplift each other in Christ and encourage each other in the Lord. Let us always pray for each other, intercede for one another, comfort each other, support each other. All those great, awesome, amazing things. Brothers and sisters of the faith all over the world, let us be together on one accord for the Lord. Amen. Much love to the 12 tribes of Israel scattered all four corners of the earth. All the scattered Israelites among the nations, all ends of the earth. Much love to the churches and ministries out there with the sound doctrine, the peace, the love, the harmony, the fellowship, and the services. Much love to all the previous martyrs, the current martyrs, and the future martyrs. The brave, bold, isolated, courageous believers who are going through it for the gospel, who are being persecuted for the faith, who are going through many tribulations for his name's sake. Stay strong, steadfast, and firm. We are with you always forever. Much love to the great tribulation of saints down the road. Much love to all the grafted in Gentiles of all nations, tribes, languages, tongues, races, faces, kindreds all over the world. Much love to all the brand new converts out there. Much love to all the Holy Spirit filled people, all the born again people, all the new creatures of Christ out there. Anyone who just repented, God bless you. Anyone who just got baptized, God bless you as well. Anyone who's having dreams, encounters, visions, and testimonies, God bless you as well. If you did not repent and get baptized, go repent and get baptized ASAP immediately. Shalom, family, greetings to all of you. Welcome everybody, all peoples, all nations, all tribes, all languages, all tongues, all races, all faces, all kindreds, everybody. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. All the animals, all the creatures, all the beasts, all the fishes in the sea, the birds in the air, the trees, the plants, the mountains, the insects. Let all of God's creation praise him. Amen. Whether you are an Israelite or a Gentile, it is all right. Whether you are chosen or adopted, grafted in, it is all right. Let us gather together and praise the Most High. Sing a new song. Clap our hands. Stomp our feet. Praise him. Rejoice. Always rejoice. Make a joyful noise. Make a joyful sound. Crowd to him. Dance. Express yourself. Play an instrument. Do what you have to do for the Most High. He is always watching us, so always serve him with gladness and joy, and always worship his spirit of truth. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one Lord. Love the Lord your God for your mind, heart, soul, strength, and might. Love your neighbor as you love yourself. And let's always do Father's business and Father's will for the rest of our lives till the sun comes back. Amen. He has come back like a thief in the night in a twinkling of an eye. He has come back at an hour nobody knows but the Father. Let us be alert, sober, vigilant, watchful, prayed up, washed by the water, by the word, the washing of the water through the word. Let us keep our lamp and oil. Let us stand on purpose and call for the most high God. Let us know the Lord better. Let's get more close to him. Let's seek his face. Draw near to God. He'll draw near to you. Let us obey the gospel. Let us obey the law, statute, commandments. Let us obey all of God's word. Anything the most high has told us personally, according to our life, our calling, our purpose, our situation, our gifts, our talents, our circumstances, handle it, people. Keep it all together for the most high. Keep the faith. Keep the word of God. Keep the testimony of the Messiah. Keep the law, statute, commandments, decrees, precepts, ordinances, covenants, judgments, charges. Write a copy of the Torah from Genesis all the way to Deuteronomy by jot, by tittle, line upon line, precept upon precept. Embrace the new covenant. And just stay strong in these times that we're in, okay? Now, today's message, what I would love to do is go through today's daily devotional. And then from there, I will close out with the prayer. I will close out with the priestly blessing. And I will close out, give it all the praise, honor, and glory to the most high God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And praise his only begotten son who died for our sins. Amen. Hallelujah. So here we go. All right. 
So today's daily devotional, the daily prayer is based also in Hebrews chapter 13, verse 15. And further into the daily devotional starts off with the quote, worship is an act of faith, trusting God even in the hardest moments. Amen. All right. This reflects on the power of praise and gratitude, even in the face of life's challenges, story, service, scripture. By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to God continually. That is the fruit of our lips, giving thanks to his name. Hebrews chapter 13, verse 15. The power of praise and gratitude. In life's toughest moments, we often forget the power of praise and gratitude. Hebrews chapter 13, verse 15 encourages us to offer the sacrifice of praise to God continually. This means praising God not just in good times, but even when it's hard. True praise is a sacrifice that comes from a heart trusting God, even in difficult times. Our praise is rooted in God's deep love for us, shown through Jesus' sacrifice. This love calls us to respond with our lives, using our gifts to share his love with the world. Our gratitude becomes a witness, pointing others to God's goodness. Let our lives reflect constant praise, even in challenges. May our gratitude and praise lead others to the hope we have in Christ. Amen. Reflection. Think about the challenges you're facing. Are you struggling to praise God in tough times? True praise is trusting God even when life is hard. When you praise him, you show faith in his goodness even when things aren't clear. Remember the love God remember the love God has shown you through Jesus. We can't repay it, but we can live with gratitude. How can your praise in both small and in big things bring hope to others today? Let your life reflect constant praise even when it's a sacrifice. Amen. We have to remind ourselves our identity is in Christ, period. What we do does not define us, our identity in Jesus Christ and what he did on the cross does. Amen. Prayer. Scripture as well, again. By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to God continually. That is the fruit of our lips, giving thanks to his name. Hebrews chapter 13, verse 15. Prayer. Dear Lord, through your sacrifice on the cross, you made atonement for my sins and brought me forth into eternal life with you. I surrendered my life to the one who loves me more than anyone ever will. You have given me the honor of serving you in this life as your ambassador. You have invested me with special gifts and talents and positioned me among those who need to hear my testimony of love divine. The most holy sacrifice I can bring in exchange for your sacrifice is offering my thanks. I will render the fruit of my lips as my sacrifice of praise. The blessings you have granted me through Christ are so abundant and inexhaustible that you can never be sufficiently praised for them. I will lift up your name and honor all that you have done for me to all those I meet along the way in my life's journey. I was dead in sin and you gave me life through your son, Jesus Christ, and drew me with cords of love into your eternal kingdom of love. It is your desire that none should perish and have have made a way of escape for all those who will receive your plan of salvation. Your goodness leads us to repentance, and your goodness is what I praise you for each day of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. Hallelujah. Praise the most high God of heaven and earth. He is the God of Shem. He's the God of Abraham. He's the God of Isaac. He's the God of Jacob. He is the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob forever. He is the God of Israel. He is the God of the Hebrews. He is the God of Jeshurun. He is the Lord of the armies. He is the God of Noah, Job, and Daniel. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. He is the God of David. Praise him. Praise the Lord. His only begotten son died for our sins. He rose up three days later. Much love to the Messiah for shedding his blood for all of us. Hallelujah. He's the last Adam, the second Adam. Praise the Lord. He is the advocate. Hallelujah. Praise him. The almighty, true and living God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The Alpha and Omega. Amen. The apostle of our profession, the arm of the Lord, the atoning sacrifice for our sins, the author and finisher of our faith, the author and perfecter of our faith, the author of life, the author of salvation, the beginning and the end, the beginning of creation of God, the beloved son. The blessed and only potent, the blessed and only ruler, the blessed and only sovereign, the branch, the bread of God, the bread of life, the bridegroom, the capstone, the captain of salvation, the chief cornerstone, the chief shepherd, Christ, the Christ of God, the consolation of Israel, the cornerstone, the counselor, wonderful counselor, the creator, the day spring, the deliverer, the desire of the nations, the door, the elect of God, Emmanuel, Emmanuel, God is with us, eternal life, everlasting father. Faith and true witness, faithful and true, the faithful witness, the first and last, the first begotten, the first born from the dead, first born over all creation, the forerunner, the gate, the glory of the Lord, God, the good shepherd, the great high priest, the great shepherd, the head of the church, the heir of all things, the high priest, holy and true, the holy one, the hope, the hope of glory, 
the horn of salvation, the I am, the I am that I am, the I am who I am, the great I am, the image of God, Jehovah, 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 Jireh, Jehovah, Shalom, Jehovah, Nassai, Jesus of Nazareth, Jesus, the judge of Israel, the judge, King eternal. He is the king of Israel. Amen. He is the king of kings. Hallelujah. He's the king of kings and Lord of lords. Hosanna, Hosanna in the highest praise. Hosanna, the son of David. Blessed be he that comes in the name of the Lord. We have blessed you out of the house of the Lord. King of saints, king of the ages, king of the Jews, the king, the lamb, the lamb of God, the lamb without blemish, the last Adam, the lawgiver, the leader and commander, the life, the life of the world, the line of the tribe of Judah, the living one, the living stone, the Lord, the Lord, our righteousness, the Lord is holiness, the Lord is my banner, the Lord is my portion, my strength, my rock, my refuge, my good fortress, my high tower, my shield, my buckler, my praise, my salvation, my redeemer, my helper, my strength, my song, my safety, my defense, my deliverer, my redeemer, my helper, our protector forever. Hallelujah. Praise him. Yah, Yahweh, Yahuwah, Yahweh, Shai, Yahweh, Ben Yahweh, Ahai, Yeshai, Yeshua, Hamashiach, Barakatha, Shalom, Shalom, Yeshua, Elohim, Yehosha, Yehusha, Yehosha, Ahai, Yeshaya, Adonai, Abba, Yahweh, Shai. Yes, he is a consuming fire. He is the father of heavenly lights. He is the father of the fatherless, the father of widows, the father of mercies. He is the God of heaven and earth. His son sits at the right hand of him. The government rests on his shoulders. He is the great physician, can heal all things, cure all things. He is the carpenter, can fix all things with God. All things are possible. Nothing is too hard for the Lord. God made everything in six days and rested on the seventh day. He could fix your situation right now in the name of Jesus. We touch and agree, y'all. Call on him and he'll show you great mighty things. Search and seek him with all your heart and you will find him. He is a rewarder to those who seek him diligently. Know that he exists. Believe in him. Trust in him. Know he could do for you. Healing, restoration, deliverance, miracles, signs, wonders. Ask the Father what you need in the Son's name and shall be given to you. Most definitely, our faith has made us well. Our faith has blessed us. Our faith has saved us. Our faith is how we overcome the world. We're justified by faith in the Messiah that just shall live by faith we walk by sight hallelujah praise and we are in agreement that the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit God is one we know that for the rest of our lives the outstretched arm of God will be in our lives forever the mighty hand of God will be in our lives forever the finger of God will be in our lives forever amen his timing is perfect time and due time and be still and know that he is God he is pa be patient people stay strong hallelujah he got us forever. Yes, he is the Lord of all, the Lord of glory, the Lord of lords, the man from heaven, the man of sorrows, the mediator of the new covenant, the mediator, the messenger of the covenant, the Messiah, the mighty God, the mighty one, the morning star, the Nazarene, the offspring of David, the only begotten son of God, our great God, our savior, our holiness, our husband, our Passover, our protection, our redemption, our righteousness, our sacrifice, the Passover lamb, the power of God, the precious cornerstone, the prince of kings, the prince of life, the prince of peace, the prophet, the redeemer. The resurrection and life, the resurrection, the resurrected, the life, the revelation, the revelator, the life giver, the abundant life, the revelation, the revelator, the righteous branch, the righteous one, the radiant one, the perfect example, the rock, the root of David, the rose of Sharon, the rule of God's creation, the rule of the kings of the earth, the savior, the seed of woman, the shepherd and bishop of souls, the Shiloh, the son of Abraham, the son of David, the son of God, the son of man. Son of the blessed, son of the most high God, the source of eternal salvation for all who obey him, the son of righteousness, the just one, the one mediator, the stone the builders rejected, the true bread, the true God, the true light, the true vine. He is the truth. Amen. He is the way. Hallelujah. He is the way, truth, and life. Praise him. The wisdom of God, the witness, the wonderful counselor, the word, the word of God, the word of life, the word of Elohim, the word made flesh, the living word, the word of life, the word of Yahusha, the word of Yahawashiah, the true word, most definitely. We know that his word is pure, fine, silver, just as David said in the Psalms. You know, that every word of God is true, pure, and false, as the book of Proverbs says. And we know that his word is a double-edged sword, as the book of Hebrews says. Amen. We touch and agree. The Messiah is the high priest of the order of Melchizedek. He is the sinless high priest. He's the everlasting king. He is the way everlasting. Hallelujah. Praise him. Let us repent and get baptized. Let us forgive others so that the Heavenly Father can forgive us. Let us write, write a copy of the Torah from Genesis all the way to Deuteronomy. Let us be blameless before the Lord our God. Let us circumcise our heart. Let God keep showing his constant kindness to us. Amen. Our situations. All right. Prayers up to everybody. Prayers up to all the poor people, all the widows, all the orphans, all the fatherless, all the tribe of Levi, all the strangers, the sojourners, the refugees, the people, all walks of life. Prayers up for the babies, the young children, the young boys, the young girls, the young women, the teenagers, the young men, the young women, the adults, the senior citizens. Prayers up for single people, married people, divorced people, widowed people, separated people. Prayers up for single parents, co-parents, and prayers up for all households, all peoples, all walks of life. Amen. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the honor and the glory forever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. 
The Lord make his face shine upon you, be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. And they shall put my name on the children of Israel, and I will bless them. Shalom. Amen. Selah. Barakatha. I'm Jarvis Kingston. I love you all. Praying for you all. Peace.